Miller and I left the train, then climbed up the tunnel to the Korolev Performance Hall. We were close to Ostan Kino Tower now. In the frozen streets, we joined the other rangers in the furious battle that began my story. Nice. I'm a great question, Andrew. Who's hoping that doesn't do the same thing? This is the beginning of the game. Nice. Glad to see you, Colonel. Did you hear that? Listen. What the hell is it? Form a circle! Alright, what guns did they give us? Just the same ones or different? Oh, we have no ammo whatsoever. And there's nothing that I can use to fire with. I just gotta run around in circles like a dipshit. Don't mind me, don't mind me. Just running around. Just preventing getting hit. Don't mind me one bit. Oh, don't scratch me, please. Stay back. Oh my goodness. Oh shit. Okay, good. Let's see. Demons! Demons! Uh, I need ammo. Okay, I think that's just like all the ammo that I can get from there. I have premium currency as well, so fuck it. I think I'm just gonna use all of that. Yeah, I am actually. 100%. Might as well use it all, right? Alright, let's get the hell out of here. I am going, 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 going. How much do how much ammo am I gonna use? Thirteen hundred rounds. Come on. Alright. I 
guess if we can't use a damn flash, then this is our new vision. Alright. Oh, hey, I can't actually open this door. I wonder what's through it. I've never been on this side. Huh. I'm safe. Sadly, I do not have a key. I don't even know where to find one, honestly. Alright, let's just get out of here. Hmm. Okay, okay, I have an idea. Climb on top of the elevator. We will try to unlock the counterweight stopper. Shit, here we go. We are not stopping. Really, you don't say. Oh my god. Holy shit, that would have been really bad if he didn't catch himself. Our tomb is lucky. Imagine going all the way up the tower just to fall right off again as soon as you get Alright, that was maybe overkill, but I wanted to use up all my ammo. through here the other way oh shit i did not notice that at all well i noticed it but i would have noticed it too late if i actually fell down there for good measure. can't go in there. No, no, even if I shoot those things. Alright. Alright, that's weird. I'm really exploring every nook and cranny right now. Eh, just you never know if there's something that you missed in the first playthrough. Do I gotta jump this? Oh, damn. 
Oh shit, quickly tapping. I don't know if I still have to keep tapping it. Okay, I think I don't have to anymore. Okay. Nice. Alright, now we can go yep, through here. Get some more filters. And now we can Oh, it's oddly peaceful. Never mind. He brings, he brings death. He's coming, he's coming to destroy us. It's around here, maybe? No, just another journal. Through here? No. Okay. Whoop. There we go. Nope. What's over here? Nothing. Just another way up. Alright, I think we gotta go through here. Oh, damn. Well, I almost fucked that up really. Just gotta make sure I don't fall again. There we go. Oh, I can just get up through here, I think. Yeah, we're good. Alright. Oh my goodness. Alright, this time I gotta go to the Oh, Jesus, fuck that scared the fuck out of me. Oh, shit. Fine, where do I go from here? Oh, there's a ladder. Stop him, stop him. Destroy, destroy him. I don't know why he said keep in touch with Artyom. I never fucking talk. Alright, we made it. We finally made it to the top. Set that bad boy down. Artyom, this signal is just perfect. Hold on for just one more minute and we'll get them. You will be, you will be stopped. He cannot be, he cannot be allowed. Oh, shit. I almost walked off the edge there. Alright. Oh. Alright. Uh, let's not go behind door number two, because that is not a good prize at all. Okay, avoid falling, maybe. That's, that's a good, good first step. So there's like really no good choice besides this one. And this isn't that great either. Oh my goodness. Mm. 
No, I'm good. He cannot be, he cannot be allowed. Yes, I can. Oh, shit. He's coming to destroy us. Damn, that is menacing looking. All right. Jesus fuck. He cannot be, he cannot be allowed. Surrender, surrender. No, I ain't going to. I'm not going to surrender. Stop him, stop him. Surrender, surrender. He's coming to destroy us. All right, I guess I just got tired of running. Oh shit, he caught us. Oh, nice. Surrender, surrender. Fucking, I knew it. Whenever it makes that little swoop noise, it always shows up behind. Oh shit. Oh, not that way. He cannot be he cannot be allowed. Well, this is getting increasingly difficult. Shit. Is that the dark one? Nope. It's the dude from the beginning of the game. If it's hostile, you kill it. So we just shot him and fainted. Cool. Where did we get a revolver from? This man once said, he who leads a war for the love of his fellow man will defeat his enemies. I led my war protecting my family and friends, protecting my home, the metro. We had won. But to this day, I wonder, when we burned the dark ones from the face of the earth, was something lost as well? It's a really great game. As I've said uh, two or three times before while well, this playthrough, during this playthrough, I think it's one of my favorite um, games of all time. It definitely sits up there with uh, Mass Effect in my mind. Mm. I liked it a lot. 
It was a lot, a lot of fun replaying it again, especially on PC. The first time I played this, it was on uh, console. And I'd actually like to talk about that more, my first playthrough in this one. The one thing that was different for me was that I didn't get enough good morale, good morality points uh, throughout the playthrough to be given a choice, I think. that's That was the reason. Uh, we got the quote-unquote uh, bad ending, but it's not like Mass Effect in the sense that your progress gets carried over and this ending matters. I think regardless of what happens, your choice in this ending or in this game, um, the next one, Metro Last Light, uh, it just carries on from as if you uh, picked uh, Destroying the Dark Ones because that's their story. So really, the uh, with this playthrough, it gives you like a false sense of... Uh, self-dictatorship or self-choice um, as if you uh, as if your choice has any meaning but it, it doesn't I believe it just carries on from uh, you destroying the dark ones regardless uh, of how much morality points you got in this one regardless it was still uh, interesting because it was still different from my first one for my first playthrough so I enjoyed that a lot and I'd like to thank anybody who stuck around and watched the whole thing it definitely was a lot of fun playing it and i hope you guys have a good rest of the day or night whenever it is you're watching this